Hello, uh, my name is Catherine Cook. I'm a chartered physiotherapist. I have had a uh, long and varied career. I went to university when I was 18 and studied physiotherapy at Cardiff. And after that, I started working in Portsmouth and I did uh, some basic rotations in the hospital down there. Um, since graduating, I've also been back to university and I studied for a PhD. That's a doctor of philosophy. So um, that means I can call myself a doctor if I want to. Um, and that uh, entailed a massive research project uh, where I looked into the differences um, that occur with ageing, particularly in walking, and how to identify people who are at risk of tripping and falling. Um, after my PhD, I've also worked for 10 years with the Ministry of Defence, with the MOD, working on military bases. And now I teach physiotherapy to undergraduate physios uh, at the University of Winchester. Uh, my degree was a three-year degree course and it was one that was validated by the Healthcare Professions Council and the Chartered Society of Physiotherapy, meaning that when I graduated, um, I was entitled to become a chartered physio. And all physiotherapists working in NHS hospitals and most physiotherapy jobs, in fact, physiotherapy is a protected title. So to call yourself a physio, you need to have a degree like mine. There are lots of other opportunities, for example, sports therapy, um, uh, sports rehab courses um, that are alternatives um, but for me physiotherapy was really the uh, the career that I wanted to get into. So my day-to-day -day life if I'm working clinically generally involves seeing patients uh, maybe for half an hour or an hour depending on um, whether I've met them before and how much time and input they need um, and physio is all about um, uh, using kind of our rehabilitation and movement to try and help people recover and um, live their best lives uh, even after illness, injury or with disability. Um, I love so many things about my job. Um, so both working clinically, that's treating and seeing patients, but also teaching physiotherapy students at university because um, it's a really fulfilling career. Um, it's a varied career. There are so many different areas you can get into. Physiotherapists work in all sorts of environments. They can work in hospitals, so in A&E, so emergency departments, in outpatients where people come in and visit physios, um, or on the wards from orthopedic wards, people with broken bones and after accidents, um, or surgery, after surgery, or on high dependency or intensive care units. And you might have seen some uh, physios involved in treating um, and helping people who are struggling with with COVID um, and also at the uh, Nightingale hospitals as well. So physios outside of hospitals can also work in the community. They can work in paediatrics with children and in special schools. They can um, be all over the place. Uh, so I think I enjoy most about my job is the variety. No two days are the same and meeting people um, and helping them along their journeys is really, really rewarding. The hardest part of my job, um, I suppose physiotherapy is a career where you're always learning. You're always learning more. There are courses to go on. There are different avenues you can take. And our knowledge and understanding and the science um, that we that we use, our evidence base, is constantly changing. So feeling that you're um, always uh, on top of your game and knowing what you're talking about is quite tricky. Um, from an emotional point of view, it can be really hard imparting bad news to people, dealing with people uh, or helping people when they're at their lowest and hardest times of their life. Um, but at the same time, that is what makes it rewarding. And physio, the community around physiotherapy um, and it, it, within the NHS and in other healthcare settings is usually really supportive and will help you through. That's probably answered why I feel my job is important as well. Um, uh, and the last question that I've been asked to answer was, what's been the most magical moment in my role? Um, 
I think my current role in teaching physiotherapy students is extremely rewarding, seeing people understand things and be able to put uh, their knowledge into practice and, and for them to find um, the job as rewarding as I do is probably really magical. Um, I teach on a new physiotherapy degree course and we're going to have our first year graduates uh, this summer and I have to say I think that probably will be my, um, that probably will, will be quite an emotional time time seeing our students go out and become fully fledged uh, autonomous physiotherapists. So I hope I've given you a whistle stop tour about physiotherapy, um, the, the joy of being a physiotherapist, the challenges of being a physiotherapist um, and uh, if you want to find me and ask me other questions um, I'm on Twitter at kcookphysio um, uh, or talk to your, your careers team. Thank you so much. Bye.